number nine. Number nine. Right across the hall from the apartment that originally caught fire and started all of this. And so you heard some kind of loud. Yeah. Heard a lot of banging, crashing. Yeah. It sounded like fighting. There was a lot of yelling. Then I heard our maintenance guy's voice yelling, Mike, Mike, where are you? Mike, come here. And then I looked out the people, couldn't see anything at all, smelled trash burning, opened up the door, got hit with a face full of smoke, could see Steve push himself back just in time before something dropped right in front of him on fire. He scurried down the hall, I slammed the door, told her to grab something, wrap around her face and get out. Turned around, grabbed some pictures of my daughter and then did the same. Well, and we turned and ran to the end down here, past where all the smoke was and everything, to check all my friends in there to make sure they got out. Didn't hear any answer forms, sat in the hall for a minute or two, then I saw one of the firemen come up and set a tank down. So, so come I inside ran, the building? Yeah, okay. so then I ran back down the hall and out the door, found her, my buddy's girlfriend, and then we freaked the hell out, came running around to the front side of the building, and luckily we found my buddy and heard us here. So then where's the, did you come out? Does that, the exit's on the back? Okay. Yeah. There's one in the back and one in the back. So did you see flames inside? Were you seeing flames or were you just seeing smoke? All I could see inside while I was running around was fire in his apartment. And that's and Mike just who you were smoke. talking about? Yeah, number okay. six. So number six. And from when we got outside and turned around and looked back at the building, we could see the flames coming out of that apartment. Yeah. And things just falling out of it. But in the time it took to shut the door, from yeah. it saying, you know, cover your face, there was smoke out there. Um, but then he shut the door, I grabbed my coat, grabbed my scarf, and, and opened the door to go out, and it was just completely...